Town, Monticello, continues here on WCIA 3 News, your local news leader. We are all missing the normalcy of our daily lives and the things that would bring us some happiness. In our town, Monticello, that joy comes in the form of a 90-year-old piano player. The elderly in long-term care centers are missing her terribly since visitors aren't allowed right now. But her music isn't the only thing that makes her an angel among us. Kathleen Foster has spent her entire life at a piano. That's what I'm supposed to do. That's what I think I'm supposed to do. She started with lessons at the age of eight. Then she was the one giving them after getting married. It was a love story that lasted 45 years. And after my husband died, nursing home was looking for a piano player for church. Foster suddenly had a new partnership. And I have been there 26 years. You see, when this 90-year-old commits, she commits. And the Pia County Nursing Home isn't her only stop. Foster also brings her talents to several other assisted living centers in town and gets others on board. I have two talents, playing the piano and talking people into things. She has this unique way of, of making it almost seem as if it's your idea. Stacy Cribbs is the director at Maple Point Supported Living, who's watched Foster work her magic, from rounding up volunteers for her singing group, Kathleen and Friends, to a talent show for residents. And she's really hard to say no to, um, and she rarely says no. So you can't hardly tell her no when you know she's going to be right there. Buster Chumbly knows it firsthand. She uh, volunteered me. She plays and he preaches. Her ability to, to give and give and give and seems to never wear out. Foster treasures the time that she plays for others, but it's when she's in front of Alzheimer's patients that touches her the most. Some of them that are sitting there and haven't talked a lot, but when I play an old song, their lips start moving. I call doing that my blessing much more than theirs. It's a ministry of music brought to a population that is sometimes forgotten. She's definitely an angel. Uh, uh, she meets the needs of people, and I know at times it's difficult for her, you know, at her age, and it's hard for her to get around at times, And but she stays with it. And isn't stopping. I tell my kids, I'll stay home when I can't go anymore. <laughs> and so far, I'm still doing it generosity and that love of serving she spread to so many people that will always carry on now foster also plays for the rotary club in our town monticello plus she gets help and donors for buses to take seniors to a living nativity at christmas time